here to do is explain how blind people use a computer because quite frankly I get that question almost all the time from people who meet me and I'm getting sick of it it's like how do you Skype how do you use computer as you know not to be mean but oh my gosh it's annoying so I will be glad to explain in depth on how a visually impaired person navigates a computer both Mac or Microsoft but I'm mainly here to explain Apple because Apple's my primary computer basically when you have a Mac, every, or really any Apple device really, there's a built-in voice program called VoiceOver. It talks. It sounds like this. VLC. Skype. Finder. Finder. You know what I'm saying? Screenflow. Like, easy as that. Caps right? Off. VLC. VLC. Rate 60%. percent slow 50%. Down a bit so you can understand it. Rate 45%. Alright. So, we're gonna Alt-Tab. Screenflow. Finder. Into my Finder. Finder's the main area in the main domain of a Mac. Or... Uh, yeah, mainly just a Mac. So let's say I want to use my applications. You know, go to my applications. I do Command Shift A. Applications sends me to my applications folder. First, before we get into this, I want to explain how you use Voiceover. Voiceover is arranged in key commands, keystrokes, different key functions that do specific things. You have two keys that are the main keys for Voiceover, and that is Option and Control. And those are mainly used to navigate left and right. Or interacting with something. So let's go down my application, shall we? Let's start in, with the D's. Daily Bible verse. Selected application, 11 of 72. So it tells you how many there are and what number it is of that, right? So let's keep going down. Dashboard. Dictionary. Dropbox. DVD player. Facebook. FaceTime. Fontbook. Game Center. GarageBand. Google Chrome. Google Drive. Google Voice. Image Capture. You know, basically like that. Pretty simple, right? So far. Um... Now, let's alt tab out of here, right? I get another question. How do you use Skype? That is one question that I tend to get all the time by people who I talk to on Skype or people who first meet me. We're going to alt tab. VLC, ScreenFlow, Skype. Skype. All right, we're in Skype. So, let's navigate all the way to the uh, the way to the left. So, what we're going to do is we're going to press VO keys. When I say VO keys, I always mean option and control. So, VO keys plus FN key plus left arrow. Toolbar. It'll take me all the way to the left. All right? So, in here, we can interact with it, so we play, uh, we, uh, push VO keys plus shift plus down arrow. Interact with toolbar. To interact with something, or we do VO keys plus shift plus up arrow to... Stop interacting with toolbar. Stop interacting. So let's interact again. Interact with toolbar. Go all the way to the left. Current picture button. Alright, now we're gonna go to the right, so we're gonna do VO keys, press right arrow. And that's how you navigate left and right most of the time through any uh, format if it's on Safari, Facebook, Twitter, blah, 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 you know. So, do not disturb pop up button. The first thing you come to in the toolbar is this the pop up menu where you can edit your status. Like if you're online away, do not disturb, something like that. The toolbar really isn't that important. This is about Skype. So, we're going to get out of there. Stop interacting. Inter stop interacting with toolbar. Toolbar. We're going to go all the way to the left again. Table, row 7 of 20. James now, it says table. The table is where all the conversations will be that you currently have open that are previous or live conversations, calls, you know. So let's interact with that. Interact with table. Rel so, VO shift keys plus down arrow. We're going to go all the way at the top. So, space, row 1 of 20. Which would be, cons which would be you know, the same thing as just going all the way to the left. So, VO keys plus FN plus left arrow. We're going to go down. So, VO keys plus down arrow. Skype home. Contacts. Current calls. Now it'll tell me my current call that I'm in, but it's not important. So. Recent. Recent. Recent is where all my chats will be, so. James the country boy. My friend James. Skype has new window. That was the last thing that I had open, so I'm going to stop interacting. Sky and I'm going to go all the way to the right. VO keys plus FN plus right arrow. Emoticon button. It takes me Insert emoticon. So, and that's where the emoticons are. Emoticons are right there, see? Emoticon button. So, if we want to, you know, choose emoticon, if you don't know how to do it uh, manually, you press VO shift, or um, VO keys plus space. Now in window, window. Now it's going to take you to the emoticon area. Choose an emoticon. Smiley button. Sad button. Big smile button. Cool button. Surprised button. Winking button. Yeah, basically, now yeah, in easy enough. So I'm going to press escape to get out of there. Now I'm going to do... Sky VO win. keys plus left arrow. Search. Search text field. Wait, let me get out of here. It took me to a different thing. So I'm going to go all the way to the right. Emoticon. Again, and we're going to go to the left. Edit text. Where I can edit and send a message. So let's say I say. HTML content. What's up? What's up? You know, typing is really easy. Just memorizing the keys. Right? Simple as that. Boom. All right. Rate 50%. Another one. Finder. Is Facebook or the internet. Applica Safari. So we're going to go to the applications Applica menu. Go back to Finder. Alt tab to Finder. And then we're going to press S. 
Park Safari. To go to Safari, because that's the first one that starts with an S, we're going to press Command O to open. Open. Safari, untitled window, HTML content. Okay. It takes you to Apple. Visited. Apple is the main page that I have set right now, because I'm too lazy to change it. I say you want to go to Facebook, right? I usually miss, I mostly use the mobile websites. We're gonna press Command L. Open location. Search Google or enter an address. App. Boom. So right. M dot Facebook dot Unhighlighted. Enter. Insertion at end of text. HTML content. Takes you to that. Boom. Easy as that, right? Main, main menu now, button. It's gonna bring you up to basically how you navigate is VO keys plus right arrow. Friend requests pop up button. Messages pop notifications one. Chat button. Entering main landmark. Status. Photo button. Check in button. What's on your mind? And Insertion that's where I can, uh, Write a status, basically. But anyway, we're gonna press Command Q to get out of there. Sky. That is basically VLC. How I use Screen flow. It is basically easy as that. Rips. If you do have any questions, feel free to send me an email through uh, Gmail, mrjt1020 at gmail.com, or Facebook or Twitter. Um, I don't check YouTube as often, but Screen flow. feel free to send me an email or send me a message on Facebook or whatnot or whatever. Thanks, guys. Peace.